advice that I would give to any teenage girl is to make sure that they got the vaccination. Which prevents against the HPV virus. The HPV virus um, can be transmitted through intimate relationships from the moment you become sexually active, even with one person. And it prevents this disease developing, um, which can lead to cervical cancer. A preventable cancer. Wow, do it. Absolutely, 100% make the most of the fact that there's a vaccination against a cancer. And it might, the, uh, the chances of the adverse reactions are so slim, but the benefits of such a an vaccination are just, well, if it stops you going through what I had to go through, 100% it's worth it. If I was to speak to somebody about the smear test, I would explain how important and how crucial it is to have those regular smear tests. I did. And although I had bleeding in between periods that alerted me to the fact that there was something more, smear test picked up, it, it confirmed it for me. And it, having this, it's a little bit, people don't have them because it's a little bit uncomfortable. A few seconds of uncomfortable sort of feelings laid on a, a, you know, a bed is nothing compared to what cervical cancer can do. They can catch it at cell changing, which can mean that it's minimal procedure to stop them before they turn into cancerous cells. Or in my case, they caught it, thankfully, early enough that it was just a hysterectomy. There are many, many women lose their life from cervical cancer every year that can be stopped by having a smear test and also having vaccination. There's steps out there that can prevent you ever having to go through what I've been through or even close to what I've been through. And those smear tests are something that people don't make the most of and it just kills me that they don't because I know it's uncomfortable and it's a bit embarrassing, especially the first one. It's not a nice thing to be going through. Right, but cervical cancer is definitely not a nice thing to go through. Way more embarrassing and way more uncomfortable. Now obviously for the older women, they can't have the vaccination now, but for the teenagers that are around, convince your daughters, your granddaughters, your goddaughters, you know, to have the vaccination. Three injections is enough to significantly reduce the chance of having a HPV virus that will go on to becoming a cervical cancer. So that and the smear test together, you know, eventually we're going to be able to, if not eradicate completely, certainly make a massive change to, to cervical cancer in the future. So for a couple of minutes of an embarrassing moment can save your life, can prevent you getting cancer. Absolutely make the most of that.